So this short video is uh, showing how we can take um, the route that we've created in Basecamp and export it um, into uh, Google Maps. And then you can share it or print it and it looks a lot nicer and it's easier to share and, it, and, and you know, send out an email or post on, on a website. Um, so <clears throat> we've got this weekend's um, ride out here for our group. And you can see I've got uh, three stages of the route and they all need to go um, out in an email so people know what's going to happen. So the first thing we're going to do is uh, export this. So go up to file and we'll export and export planning. And um, <clears throat> I've got it. I'm going to put it into this uh, this folder here. It doesn't matter where you put it as long as you can remember. Give it a name. Make sure it's a GPX and that is it. Save. OK, so that's now exported quick and easy. It's only a few kilobytes. Uh, then pop over to the Internet. And the website you're looking for is this fantastic website called GPS Visualizer. It's free to use. Um, the guy who runs it, um, you know, he's got a little donate button over here. I've sent him a five pound a couple of times because um, I think they'll buy him a beer. He's, you know, he's done, he's done a great job. Um, this is, I find it immensely useful. I use it all the time. So uh, a beer now and again, it's just my way of saying uh, I thank you very much. Uh, you can see it's very simple to use over here um, on the left hand side we have a get started upload a gps file choose a file click on that go and find the um go and find the folder that you saved your gpx file in and there's my three counties and that's it and we'll leave it as google maps and just click on map it So it um, takes a few seconds and then it opens up another web page. And, you know, that's that's useful. Um, but I always um, view it by clicking this hyperlink here to view or you can download it. So I just view it. it takes me to a, a fuller web page now without all that gump on it. And you can see up here I've got the, the three routes and they're all in different colors and with all the um, waypoints marked out on it um, and you can change the type of map so at the moment it's uh, a hybrid map so it's a bit of a bit of satellite and a bit of road mapping on there you can just have a, your bog standard google map that's easy enough um, and you take it away from google map you can have um, the open street map uh, there as well so that's quite good um, open topo map whatever topo is topo uh, one of the uh, one of the really good ones, especially if you're going somewhere a bit hilly, is uh, to use the Google Terrain map, and um, because that gives you gives you an idea of you know wh wh where we're going, where, you know how high you're climbing. The same as you can do it with the uh, OSM TF map. So it's basically it's choosing which map you want. So I'm going to stick with Google Terrain, and once I've got this, uh, I do something really simple now. I just do a screenshot. Uh, so, simple screenshot. There we go. And then I open a program called Paint.net. Another free program, free to use. They, you know, will ask you if you want to give them a donation through PayPal. Um, again, I've given them five pounds. I think it's a fantastic program. Um, so very simple. I paste it in. It paste. Um, I expand the canvas to make it the right size. There we go. There it is. There's my screen. There's my screenshot. Um, and then I export it. So save as. Save it as a JPEG. And I'll go and put it in the same folder that I had everything else in. So three counties. Okay, so now I have a um, an image file that I can chuck into an email, send it out to people, and people can see um, what the route is, where we're going. So that's it. That's how to convert uh, a 
Garmin Basecamp map into a pretty nice looking um, Google Maps there.